I can't believe him. The absolute gull of a man to continuously do this. Jason is just so inconsiderate. And this is typical behavior for him. He knows that they're my cookies. And he knows that touching my stuff directly violates rule six. Don't touch my stuff. He's gonna pay. Uh, Caleb, I'm just gonna head out for a couple of hours. Before you go, I have a few questions for you. Uh, listen, listen, I don't have time for It'll this. It'll be quick! <sighs> Alright, fine. What do you want? Do you notice anything different about the kitchen? No. Funny, I thought you would. What's this? A cookie jar? Yeah, good. Now, what's in the jar? Nothing? Yes, exactly nothing! What's the problem here, Caleb? You want to buy more cookies for you? Buy your own cookies. Stop playing games with me, Jason. Games? I know you ate all my cookies! What? He's always doing this. Wasting my time with this crap. There was always something. Usually I'd let this go, but he's not letting me leave. I have a date to get to. <sighs> Look at him cowering. The coward. He knows what he's done. I don't know why you keep trying to deny it. It's either you or me, and I'm pretty sure it's not me. Can you just drop it? It's no big deal. No big deal? <laughs> okay then, all right. It's no big deal, okay, I'll just let it go then. Oh, come on, you're just being ridiculous now. I'm being ridiculous? You know what's ridiculous is that you keep trying to express your innocence when you're clearly guilty. Jesus Christ. You're not taking this investigation seriously. You know what? Fine. I think we need an impartial third party. I'm calling Alex. <laughs> of course he calls Alex. <laughs> of course he does. <sighs> Alex is a friend of ours from high school. Uh, he was a year older than us. Caleb thinks he's really cool. So whenever he has a problem, he calls him. Alex really hates it. Don't call Alex. I'm gonna do it, it's for your own good. He's probably at work. Shut up, it's ringing. Hello? Hey Alex, what's up man? <sighs> what do you want, Caleb? Oh, uh, me and Jason just uh, got into a bit of an argument. Oh my god. Go ahead. So I went downstairs today to uh, grab a cookie, only to notice to my horror that they were all gone. I know I didn't eat them. What do you think? Listen, I don't have time for this. I'm at work. Y yeah, but... Don't call me unless it's actually important. I've told you this before. It is important. <laughs> he was probably just having an off day. I mean, uh, it's fine. I still know it was Jason. I just need him to admit it. Hey, this was fun, but I actually Wait, have to go. No, you can't leave! Not until you admit it! Get off me! I didn't eat your stupid cookies, man! Caleb is really starting to worry me now. I mean, look at him! I didn't want to do this, but you forced my hand. What are you on about now? Don't make me do this. Uh, just spit it out. You wouldn't say, happened to have had anyone over last night, did you? <laughs> you did, didn't you? How is that your business? You know that directly violates rule three, right? Your rules are BS. It's my house, my rules. This isn't your house. Your house sitting for David, remember? You need to call the girl you had over last night and bring her here. I need to interrogate her too. You need help if you think I'm going to call her over now. Not only are your rules BS, but you are too. You're the most controlling, selfish, annoying, manic little cretin I've ever met. Well, you're too dismissive. It, it, it's impossible to have a real conversation with you because... You're always trying to hide your feelings. Too scared to confront your emotions. I'm leaving! No, I'm not sorry. Caleb is always doing this and I'm sick of it. I, I try to stay calm and humor him, but sometimes he just goes too far. 
You don't think it, you went too far. Well, no, because of him, now I'm going to be late for my date. I, I, I mean, what he did was way worse, right? Why do I keep doing this? Oh, you're still here. You don't think I was wrong, do you? What do I do? You're back! Listen, Caleb. I I'm sorry. Not for eating your cookies, which uh, I did, by the way. But I'm sorry for being so distant and dismissive. No, I'm sorry. You're right. I am controlling. And selfish. Yeah, that too. And manic, paranoid, delusional. Okay, okay. I get it. I'm sorry. Jason!